I'm David Ferreira. I'm the Managing Director for Innovative Finance at the Gavi Alliance. So we're very excited to be announcing a new commitment at the CGI this year on Thursday. And it is about the global supply chain for vaccines. So if you imagine, a vaccine has to get from the point of manufacture in India or Singapore or Belgium. And ultimately, it gets to a kid in a remote rural area in Africa or Asia or Latin America. And it has to be cold all the way. So there's lots of opportunity for wastage and therefore for economies. And in addition, we have to manage the stock very carefully. It doesn't help to have too much stock in one clinic and too little in another, or too much stock of vaccine in one country and too little stock in another country. So the opportunity cost of not managing the global supply chain well is massive in terms of lives, but also in terms of money. So we will be announcing that we are being joined by these corporate partners to contribute their resources to resolving our supply chain issues. But the even better news is that the contributions made by these partners will be doubled in value. They'll be doubled by the Bill and Melinda Gates Foundation and the government of the United Kingdom through an instrument we have called the Gavi Matching Fund. So the project that we have scoped with Vodafone starts in Mozambique, and if it works out well there, as we expect it will, we'll take it to other countries. And what does that involve? It involves using their technology and their business practices to register live births, to register actual immunizations, to get parents back for a second and third shot that their kids need, to monitor stock levels, to monitor stock expiry dates, and to upload all of that into a database that is transparently available real time and online. So that answers the type of questions that I was talking about earlier. Where is the stock? When does it expire? How much of it do we need? Can we move it elsewhere? Can we get it from elsewhere? So I think a really meaningful impact to the challenges that we've identified.